I want to deal with a normal, mentally stable, healthy woman. So and you think you're normal? Exactly. In, in what sense? Well, do you think you have healthy habits? Yeah. You do? Yeah. Weren't you the same mm -hmm. one who like fat shamed me like last week or so? I don't you know. think that's normal from a man, from a stranger to stranger to fat shame somebody? I don't remember. Did I call you fat? Oh, okay. Don't do, don't do that. You know what you were in the chat. <laughs> you knew you were in the chat. Don't oh, called out. He was a chatter. Don't, don't do that on camera. I don't know. Don't do that. Don't yeah, do that. Like, oh, 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 and Matt is calling oh, him out. Oh. Let's go. You Wait, were in like, a chat with your checkmark name doing that. What so was I saying? Oh. Listen, it's okay if you want to. How? Why wouldn't you just own it? Own it. Like yeah. just say like, yeah, I think you're a fat bitch. Boom, and then own it. Why would you say be like, oh? Oh, that was me. I don't know. Did I do that? I don't know. Did I do, do that? those things? Yeah. But own up to what you do. What was I saying? I mean, women are apparently. Oh my god, I hate this guy so much. <laughs> like CEO, I'm not taking accountability, but I mean, I guess you should change your pronouns because I'd say you're. This she's such a. I love this woman over here. She's so. Oh, she's just. Firing shots all around. I... Let's go. <sighs> kind of in the same bracket when it comes to that. All right, I'll get right on that. And that's not masculine energy. Just masculine like, energy. I value men. Remember, I told you so that. Don't call people whores either. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm... That's true. She said it because this guy, I think, called Farah, uh, one of my friends. He called her a hoe on the mm -hmm. show for no reason. And Melina said, "That's not very masculine. Don't mm -hmm. do that." I mean, I, I, women can't handle criticism. I took that like a champ. That's fine. I'll take that. But I think you yourself, as a man, should probably work on that instead of saying that I don't want to traumatize women because it definitely shows. That I don't want to. I don't want to traumatize. Women. We don't want to traumatize men either. That's the thing. So okay. that's why it's easier to go to Japan and find that. I need you a type of girl because they're not going to debate with you. <laughs> oh, 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 the passport bro call out album. that's right they're just robotic female slaves in japan they have no personalities it they shows. just say go eat you all yeah so me tell you all that shit that you like it's, it's evident that you're used to women who don't check you when you're being irrational thanks. and way out of place Th thanks for the whole synopsis on the 37 years of my it life shows. You've, uh, well you've it really doesn't mean to a lot of people it shows like you could be my grandma's 80 years old and still drives like shit that doesn't matter how old you are so i would have to say <laughs> uh -huh. you sound like somebody who really looks down on women with the way that i mean you even made a whole hit piece on that i think that's weird i didn't make a hit piece on her this guy you should really change your pronouns because I could see that's not your best best trait to actually own up to what you do. And I think that's really disgusting. <laughs> <Why don't> you... <laughs> that was a sick burn. Oh my God. <sighs> just sit in your masculine energy and maybe just apologize for what you said. I think that that's very masculine. I think that's a great way because I feel like number one in a war, everyone thinks they're right, right? Yes. So Holy I think that right shit. now is a great opportunity. Damn. It's like smoldering over yeah, there. Yeah, literally. Ready for you to show that men can be masculine and have feelings and can also regress and think back about what they said. Maybe in the moment you said it because you got excited or whatever and you were just in, in this phase of yours. But I think sitting here in front of her, you're talking about that you want this wife and this submissive person and all of this, but where's your respect towards women? Yes. And don't you run like an entire male empowerment, empowerment thing? Like, I think that's important that people look up to you. And you know what's funny? I actually subscribed to you prior to you doing that. I thought that was so out of pocket. And I was like, wow, like people like you, respectfully to anyone that's listening. This is why I stepped out of the red pill space because you guys are so quick to demonize women in the West. But mind you, all of This is real quick. Her experience is one I've heard from conservative women a lot too. Mm -hmm. That conservative women, they get involved in conservative spaces mm -hmm. and they grow to hate conservative men. Well, I mean, because, Red Pill and, cons and, and TradCon are a little bit different, I know, right? No, I There's... agree with you that they're different, but in almost all of these male-dominated spaces, mm -hmm. the men are trash. In even in, in the TradCon, tra tra not, yes. not even talking about yes. Red Pull. Yes, okay. yes, Even in the really? TradCon space, the men are trash. Okay. They, m more but often isn't that by definition the exact opposite of like, like they're meant to be these yeah, the I know they're meant to, but moral, here, here, more often than not, example. more often than not, what happens? And I'm ragging on men right now, but women probably do it too in their own spaces. Anytime you've got a space dedicated to a bunch of people that get together and they all come in a giant circle on some picture of fucking Lindsay Lohan crying about how evil all women are, you're probably going to be a bunch of over entitled man babies that don't amount to shit. Ninety nine percent of the time, that's the type of people that inhabit these spaces. I mean, that's still Red Pill versus Tradcon. That's it, very I'm different. saying it happens in Tradcon spaces and it happens it, in but, Red Pill spaces. No, here's the, here's the thing: if you're, you know, all, all the Tradcon guys that are like, oh, like I'm a, I'm Tradcon and there are no traditional women left, blah, 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 blah. None of those are Tradcon guys. If you're a traditional conservative guy that has strong values, you own a business, you've got a good job, you've got good values, you've got your life together and you're a stable person, you have no problem getting a traditional uh, conservative woman. You will never have problems finding them because the amount of those men that exist are so f And that's why I feel like there's a lot of people who've been gravitating to this red pill space because I feel like it's become like a, a, a popularized like modern solution for Tradcon, right? That's meant to be more adapted to the current culture. Sure, but and even the these guys blah, blah, blah. are usually like garbage as well. Like all of these guys are creepy, weird. Not all of like. them. I mean, oh, the red pill spaces. This guy's a horrible representation. This guy, I literally disliked every single thing that's come out of his mouth. Sure. But I, I don't think you can say that it's a net negative for all red pill guys. Like the sneakers, fresh and fit. All of those people out, like they're. I mean, Sneeko's abandoned the red pill space, so he's not even part of it anymore. I mean, he's okay, whatever. So like, Jordan Peterson is still meant to be like the. the... I don't know if he's even. I don't think Jordan Peterson would co-sign one-ended open relationships. Okay, yeah, but that's just one facet of the red pill. Again, the red pill. I is I don't more think Jordan so... Peterson would agree that you should. 50 women by the time you're 30. Again, this is just what this is what I was saying that people take a 
uh, an inch and, and and then they take a mile. Sure. It's like that's not what it was ever meant to denote. And I think people use that as an excuse to justify whatever outcome it is that they're wanting sure. or they're preaching. I'm for. just saying that a lot of these spaces have a lot of f things with the men here. They're not. These girls have been working since we were old enough to work. A lot of us have to retire our families. But instead of people seeing that, you guys demonize women for masculine traits when we're also working just like you. And we, I mean, I don't expect to respect, but like there was no beef and it was so unnecessary. And I think it's, I mean, that's accountability that some people should take, but to each their own. Yes. Just saying. What you, so what are you upset that I called you fat? This is upset. I mean, this is clear, upset. Clearly. This is a I also <laughs> hate that like, and it's funny because like I see, because I, I remember it, it, it's because I've got a 12 year old son and I know what it looks like when like a, like a little kid gets caught um, mm -hmm. and they're like, oh, yeah, like yeah. Nathan, did you wash your hands? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and it's like, and you know, like, bro, uh -huh. like, yeah. yeah kids I have a are... 13 year old little brother, so. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> little kid, it's probably true for boys and girls, mm -hmm. but little boys, they're so bad at hiding when they've done something when wrong. They you know, we, you, have you seen the videos where you go in and there's like two dogs and it's like, who ruined the thing? And one right. of the dogs is like, yeah, the, looking like around, kids yeah. are the exact same. Mm -hmm. Where well, you go and you're like, hey, I noticed something's broken in the kitchen. And they could be like, what? Yeah. What happened? <laughs> what? I, no did, I thought I heard somebody come in earlier. And it was right. like, somebody broke in the house? You think I'm Right. Yeah, but it's like he's like the same thing. Like, what yeah. did I say? I called you fat. What? I don't what are you talking it's about? It's like that same type of like, like deflection. Yeah. Like, yeah. it's so passive. I totally. I and see that. And it's so that funny to sure. analyze like from like the top bottom energy here. I to borrow from an old friend. Like she's right. so dominant in this conversation, and he's so like, I don't what? remember saying anything. Yeah. Like I didn't make that video. Like, oh my god. Sorry, but. Address it. Well, why don't you want to own up to what you said, though? Why what are you was denying it? What was it? it? Was it? We're kind of built the same, which is funny, dude. We're like, I mean, come on, man. You can't be sitting there acting like, oh! oh, no. One of his four pillars is getting fit, and now she's calling him out. We're like, oh, and I'm like, dude, honestly, that's so out of pocket in so many ways. Well, so, how about this? Yeah. You know, I just came out of left field, but I don't know. I'm like tuned in right now. Like, <laughs> yeah, well, I didn't know this was happening. And Adam, I'm going to call Adam out a little bit here. Adam is content right now to cover for, I think, a friend. Because Adam should have let that interaction play out. There's no reason we're stepping here because. Oh really? Yeah, because this is like so. This is about right. to be some. Yeah. This is about to be some. Try now. This is about to be some wild uh, content, and now Adam is stepping in to cover for his friend because he knows his friend is getting cooked alive over here. Okay. <laughs> on my up, show, but here we go. Up to what was said and let him clear so the room. If we misinterpreted, good. ladies, hold on. If we didn't right. understand, let him so clear the just, air. Just, I'm, guys, let me just host the show for a second. <laughs> You're upset because why? I think that, listen, criticism, sure, but be real and own up to whatever mistake you make. Because yes. again, you are okay. leading whatever what, what, group you What are. did I say? What is so upsetting? I don't, I don't get it. And why did you is, talk is to this, me? You is this chick what supposed to be attractive? Why, why you do you... all this content and you comment all these things, but you don't remember what you do. But you have all the comments to be made. No, it's okay. I'll just endure this like I should in an abusive oh! relationship. That's, those are all the clips that went viral like, Oh my God. Oh, oh my God. I should just endure. Just endure. Jesus. Endure. Right. <laughs> Did she write a script for this? <laughs> She's on Okay, so MLD, what? <laughs> he has nothing to say. What do you recall of this? <laughs> the, I'm still waiting for that. Like, I don't get it. What, what was said that made you so upset? This is a, this is the problem. So if, if we reverse the roles, if a woman addressed this, you'd be like, you're being not, emotional. I'm not going to answer the question. There is nothing. I've why said don't it like five times. you answer the question? I'm asking the question. Well, why are you so mad? This is She's mad. already Look how ready it. he is. He's literally like a fucking tomato. This is like you get caught doing some <laughs> shit in a relationship and your girlfriend or your boyfriend is like, so like, who I'm were you talking to yesterday? And you're no like, one. well, what do you mean? You're like, having like a physiological reaction yeah, yeah. all over your fucking I'm like, well, what do you mean? Who was I talking to? It's like, I heard some shit. It's like, well, who did you what hear it from? Like, who did you hear that I spoke to? Like, what do you mean? I was at French yesterday. Like, oh my God. All right, hold on. Captain Tomato. Captain Tomato for real. You said you saying that he called you fat and you were He wasn't that ready to go. Oh no, he was not for it like okay. oh my bad i was because probably just he's talking on about Hennessy. women that they have to do x y and z and all this that this what they have to do yeah. and you shouldn't you know treat women badly because they have to submit to you and in tokyo or whatever they're so feminine and this and that but it's here you these are the western women that these guys are trying to avoid you see what's going on here right. you come here and when there's women are making valid points and there are respectable women you come in the chat and you fat shame or you go and make pieces about people or whatever it is that you want to do at the end of Day, all that's being said is that listen if you're gonna do those things own up to it and then make your point about it if you're gonna do these things and you're not gonna own up to it and you're then then what's the point you're just what bullying people Are you like, it to normal like, speed this yeah. is normal speed now i turned it oh, on yeah okay yeah. there's no integrity in what you stand on like you nowadays oh. like you're running a space where men stand on principles and honor but like you see someone's face and you completely dismiss the fact that that was disgusting like disgusting we're not in a call of duty lobby like i don't know you
It wasn't like I've said something to you. I said anything to you. I've stepped out of the combative space of the red pill stuff because of guys like you. And oh! You you prove my. And this is true. I believe it. However, you'll see after a year or two. Okay, you'll you'll be you'll believe this. <laughs> you spend enough time in these spaces, and you'll come out hating every guy in the space every single time. It will Point always. It's like I don't know you. You don't have to do that, and that's fine. Mm -hmm. It's fine if I said that like, you're not my preference. I've never attacked you before. I don't generalize like that, though. Like, there's people, like, I hate the blue pill, but I love your content. Sure. I feel like it's different for everybody. Hey, you, listen, can't, you can't make generalizations like you that. You absolutely can. But if you stay in, like, blue pill content enough, these guys are all f Everybody online is f so okay? Just all men are trash, okay? <laughs> but, like, and, and women suck, too. But <laughs> waiting for what made you upset? It's okay. Right now, we're going to... What? Oh. I'm going to call you the delusional girl. All right. How about I just... Yeah. We can just stick you to that. just leave? Because this is... Re <laughs> no, I will... <laughs> He gets the uh, modicum of pushback, and he's this. I'm gonna leave. You're, you're upset because Why would you, leave? Wait, wait, wait. You, let's, let's... you literally are. You're an example. Can for somebody men. tell me what you're I said that everybody's so upset about that I'm still waiting on? What was the example? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Why? I'm just what look at you... the <laughs> look at the faces. <laughs> Look at this, look at the color. <laughs> how many, how many shades <laughs> off here is this guy's face? He's like, this is how red he is. <laughs> this is Molina's face. Wait, fuck, where's my paint bucket? Holy shit. Molina's like the other darkest person here. <laughs> it's what are we doing? Tan, okay. Oh, you're going to. Record me without my consent? Yep. He, Jesus, he's like, oh my God. <laughs> this guy's like two insults away from having a pass. Like, holy shit. He's like, well, then, just okay, to be clear. I'll, I'll do the three. Was it three? <laughs> nah, I'm pretty sure it was. Is this chick supposed to be attractive? One. Two, Ooh. she's 40 pounds too heavy. Oh, and she's got the exact quotes. Yep. X, Y, Z, something about weight. Uh, I wouldn't listen to her. Like, you just went on a rant. It was like. How do you know that that was him, though? Because. It it was his name with the check mark in the chat. Do you recall doing that? I guess so. so <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> it's like Nathan getting caught doing yes, something it wrong. Exactly. It's like it's like it's, it's like, like a little a boy. It's like a little kid. A child, Look at yes. his ears. It's literally like <laughs> red as the devil's dick right now. <laughs> oh my god! Come on. So uh, okay, you're so mad. You you're you're, you're mad because I said you're you forty pounds <laughs> overweight. <laughs> I'm <laughs> on every chat. I'm in Fresh and Fit. You know how it is when you're a streamer. You're in all these chats. I did like six shows in the last six days. So just I, I, yeah, so have I. I've done more brutal schedules than I've never been in a chat telling people fat. Fat bitches. Yeah. Like. <laughs> or if I am in their chat you're talking gonna... shit, I'm going to talk shit on the program too. Like the thing is too, this guy would have looked so much better. And this is like, now I'm going to make a character attack instead of just saying that you shouldn't insult people. He's actually weak. Because he could have just said, yeah, I think you're fat and overweight. I'm not into that. And I will make fun of you before because we should make fun of fat people. But he could have just said that and owned it. But right. him just like playing it back. Yeah, I know. He'd be like, what did like, I say? I don't, I don't remember what yeah. I said. Yeah, just say she's a fat bitch. Say she's way too Are you way like, girl, yeah, whales, yeah. whales. Like, yeah, like, fucking like, yeah. whales, bro. It's like kindergarten stuff. It's like the whenever you're like, oh, yeah, but Tommy, you actually did hit Johnny. No, and that's <laughs> funny because you know who is you know who would be one of the more masculine people in these spaces? It would be it would be Pearl. Yeah. Because if Pearl was here, Pearl would say, Yeah, yeah you're I, a whale, I, bro. You're a whale, and I um <laughs> Whales here, whales, there whales. Yeah, everywhere. she would say that. Pearl would actually say that one hundred percent. Just say sorry. So just own no, up no, to being wait, a piece of shit. Well, no, no, so I'm not so first of all, I'm not a piece of shit. You don't so think don't that's piece of like shit that. behavior. Okay, don't talk to me like that. All right. <laughs> Second, I like to try to reclaim the mess. Like, don't talk to me like that. <laughs> so, all right. I said what I said. I do think maybe you were 40 pounds. Now I said yeah. what I said. Now he wants to own it after he gets called out on it, right. after the receipts are brought out, after he spent like 10 minutes being like, I don't know what I said. I don't know what it was. I don't remember. What did I say? What did I say? Uh, I did say what I said. Okay. Pounds <laughs> overweight. Sure. So what's wrong with that? We can match each other's energy. All I had to say was you need to like own up to your shit because it's wow. weird that you would I just face did. me. Yeah, after like pulling teeth, are you good? No, after you talking over me and freaking this trauma dumping the live that? on the trauma, trauma dumping? dumping. Who's trauma dumping? Show. Show. And the funny thing was at the beginning of the show, this guy was like, "Yeah, I've had like four women trauma dump on me." What is is this? What he means that like? 
you I don't pick know these words said. and like you you throw them onto you. But if I were, if I acted the way you act, you would demonize me. If I literally attacked you the way you attacked me, if I said the things that that's disrespectful. If another man said the shit that you said to me, oh, that's fighting words. But yet a woman. But I didn't I, call I, you I, any of those where's things. Where's the vein coming out of my neck that I'm so triggered right now that oh she's mad? I think it's disgusting that you act the way. It's so like unattractive and not manly but yet you sit here and True. shame women oh i can't wait to go back to japan i just think there again you're leading a bunch of cows to follow you and you're like yeah this is how men should act that's not how men in my family and in my life act and it's so unattractive that you think that's normal so you are part of the problem in the west is what i'm basically okay. saying okay <laughs> I mean, oh <laughs> And the thing is, she's conducted herself like so well on the show. She hasn't got like she is uh, exuding the most masculine energy. She's been very fact of the matter, very straightforward in everything. Hasn't been oh, yeah. emotional, hasn't cried, hasn't. She's hmm. been boom, 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 boom. And she like the thing, too, that's like so awkward here is she really did. She just dressed him down like a mom. Like yes, you're being did, yes. you're out of pocket. Yep. You're misbehaving. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I want you to own up to what you've oh, done. Yeah. Real men don't act like this. OK, mm -hmm. you need to take responsibility and stop being part of the problem. Like she just. Completely mom moded him. Literally. So let's try to put a silver lining on this thing. This came out of class. How should he have acted, in your opinion? We walked in the green room. All you had to do was say, hey, no hard feelings. I was just on the little juice a little bit. I was tripping my bad. I would have been like, all right, bro. Like, all fairs work. That's fine. I would have mm -hmm. dropped it. But the fact that you walk in the room, you don't address it. You sit here. It's, like, awkward. I'm like... This is how, again, you, people like you want women to submit to this garbage nonsense. And you're well, women are not submissive. Why would I submit to that type of activity? Right. Oh, my God. Facts. And then she, like, wraps up, like, the whole yes. everything on. Facts. She's just perfect. As he's, like, the, <laughs> mm -hmm. he's, like, the exemplary shining star of why men in the West Which feel like they need problem. to run. This is anything. why it's a problem where red, red pill platforms platform these types of people because it becomes the embodiment mm. or the, the prototype of what the red pill is meant to be when realistically it shouldn't be. It really shouldn't be. These just end up becoming the caricatures and the mascots for it, yeah. unfortunately. This is why, despite my problems with maybe how he conducts himself and I disagree with almost everything he says, at least my is really upfront with everything. If he right. hates a woman, he says he's a bitch, he'll say it to her face. He's not right. going to fake play or whatever. Yeah, yeah. I give it, I'll at least respect him for that. Right. I'll at least respect him for that. Yeah. Thank you. But again, this is showbiz. That's fine. You're totally entitled to that. I'll give you, a, you know. <laughs> I didn't even know who. Adam's trying to bail him out. Of is he about to do the I don't know you card? Showbiz. That's fine. You're totally entitled to that. I'll give you, a, you know. I didn't even know who she is when I was in the waiting room. That's the whole oh point. Oh my God. You, you are meant for the camera, my friend. You are something else. You don't know who she was when you were in the chat? No. It's, it's, no. In the it's camera? In the, in the back room? <laughs> no, it's okay. All right, well, how about this? Oh my God. Is there anything you, you would like to yourself. take back Good or job. apologize? Whatever you want. No, not oh, a, after okay. being treated no. like that. Absolutely not. After being treated like that, she has been nothing but respectful to oh, this yeah, guy. For sure. Considering everything he said, she's been like, listen, if you would have been straightforward, it would have been fine. If you would have apologized, it would have been fine. If you would have said whatever, then we could have kept it, you know. After being treated what? like He's that? just a child. And he's like so indignant. Nah, I'm not gonna be talked down to by like some child that has no decency to communicate with me in a respectful Can manner. It starts with you. What? Okay. Oh, yeah. It starts with you. <laughs> <sighs> oh my God. And leads a relationship like that. You don't even She's have to lead right. a general yeah. All right, you guys, you guys are better than me. You win. Cool. Next, uh, next okay. question. Amazing. Anyway, She's not talking uh, down to you. She's a. You guys good? She's just Amazing. You. you guys good? Such a childish thing to All say. Right. I had like three more top. This is me and Melina when we fight. And I'm like, okay, Mel, you win. Get the yeah. out of here. Fuck up. Just to get to, but I'm sitting in the middle of this like, holy shit. Uh, anyway, I hope you guys at least after the show can hug it out. I don't know if that's possible. I got a hard out at six. I told you. Okay, we gotta get you on. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this last segment. This came out of nowhere. This is live TV, ladies and gentlemen. I didn't expect that happening. But I hope you guys genuinely can figure this out after the show. No hard feelings. I understand where you're at. I understand where you're at. Um, Natalia, yeah. final super chats. Let's get some, some winners okay, and we'll we go, go to the happy ending and we got to wrap up for today. Okay, so I will go through. <laughs> uh, let's see where to start. I'll start with so the one on my awkward. screen right here. Bean Cheeks, I never subbed to Angela or MLD, but Angela got my vote for the for the rose. Typical red pill guys never take accountability for the same way OnlyFans girls in their future. Uh, then we have this one, Bean Cheeks. Have more enthusiasm reading the chat. I will. Uh, then we have Paul We Todd. Divorce is actually worse than average men. They end up lying um, in their cars and uh, sitting on earth for men at 40. Self-destruction. Sorry, it was a little blurry when I took a picture. Uh, then we have uh, Redo. Uh, Hold on, guys. Uh, as we're doing this, uh, production team, real quick. I know we're, we're wrapping up. 
MLD literally has to go. He's yeah. not walking off. No. He said at 6 o'clock he needed to hard out at 6 o'clock right now. Uh, MLD, final words before you run off. I don't want to go out like this. Anything you would like to say before you do? <laughs> <I got it. laughs> Look at this guy. Famous lost Bro, it actually looks Look like... Look at this God, look at him right now, right here. He's like He's... Smeagol. He's like actually in <laughs> goblin mode right now. Right now. Uh, MLD, final words before you <laughs> run off. I don't want to go out like this. <laughs> he looks like he's doing the one chip challenge. <laughs> yes, he is. He's not okay. He's not he okay. He's not having a good week. <laughs> this is not a good week for him. Look at the like difference in the color on his hands <laughs> and his face. What the no. <laughs> oh no. Anything you would like to say before you do? I got nothing to say. Oh man. <laughs> See? My point. <laughs> Alright, brother. <laughs> of course, bro. Joey, let's make sure he gets out safely. <laughs> Sorry, oh, so Wow. <laughs> anyway. And we're the ones that get You're our baby. Good guys, <laughs> just, uh, listen, for the record, just so everyone's on the same page here, me and MLD are cool. We've got zero issues. He's always been super respectful. <laughs> no, but at the same time, you and I are also very cool. We've also been very respectful together. This is on you guys to address publicly, privately, whatever. Ooh. This is on you guys. I appreciate that, Destiny. All right, bye. Remember to hit that like and subscribe, and don't forget the notification bell so that my videos show up right in your feed.